How's it going everybody? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Brawlhalla for you today. As always, hope you're all having a beautiful day, wherever you might be. And where are my Scythe players at? That's right, today we're going to be playing some Scythe and some Lance, because we're playing Artemis. Artemis has both, and she is the only legend that has both, of course. And yes, Artemis is a she, a girl, you can look it up in the lore, you know, that stuff that people read to learn about the legend. Yeah, that stuff. Well, anyways, <laughs> I have every skin in the game for Artemis, I'm pretty sure. Uh, I don't know if we're going to get to be able to play every skin, but at least I can show you them. Uh, they do look really cool in every color, as you can imagine, but of course, if you want to see all these for yourselves, you can always go into the image render tool if you're on PC, but if you're on console, it is what it is. Anyways, we're going to start this video out strong with Eclipse Artemis. This is probably my favorite Artemis skin in the game. I guess I'll go Gala colors for now because I really like the white uh, spacesuit. You know, white spacesuit, just, it just goes well. Spacesuits and white, I don't know why, you know, they just go really well. And anyways, <laughs> hope you guys are enjoying your day. And if you enjoyed the video, please go ahead and drop a like so I know that you like this kind of thing. All right, we're going against a Val player. Val's a pretty popular legend, but, I mean, she has sword and gauntlets, two really good weapons, so not expected right there. Alright, going against Ninja Sword, dude. We got Lucian Sword and Ninja Sword. Beautiful. I actually meant to do a neutral stick because Artemis has an amazing... Okay, she doesn't jump, like, as a reaction. I need to remember that. We'll just do down sigs and side sigs then, not a problem. Lance has the reach, so if she want to hit me, she's going to have to get really close. Wall of Death. Another good thing about the Lance is if they are like on the edge and they're trying to get back, you can throw it up like this. Let it fall. A lot of times it'll create a big wall. And even if they don't hit it, they're going to have to try to dodge it, you know, and that'll create opportunities for you to punish. Now, I'm not the best Artemis player out there, but I definitely can get Diamond with Artemis, so hopefully, if you're not Diamond already yourself, you can learn something from me. Boom! The Down Sig, again, it is a really good move because of how far that orb goes down. If you're, if you're lucky, they'll just get hit by it from the splash damage. Like, if it hits the stage, you see that it splashes big. But if it doesn't hit the stage, it's a smaller hitbox, so you gotta be careful. He probably thinks I'm taunting on him, but I wasn't really. Uh, Alright, I'll let him get the weapon. Feels bad, feels bad. Alright, there you go. Artemis is also the fastest scythe legend in the game. Fastest moving, I should say. The weapon hits are not the fastest, but... Oh, okay. And because she can move fast, she can get in a lot of attacks before they know what's going on, you know what I mean? Oh my goodness, the Val side zig! Such a good move, I love hitting that when I'm using Val. All right, she's in deep red, so at this point, I recommend just spamming side sig <laughs> on Lance, especially. The side sig on the uh, scythe is a little bit more risky uh, because you don't go as far, and it's a little bit longer on the recovery, I feel like, but the Lance side sig, whew, that goes far, and it is fast. Wow, that looks really good in the Gala colors. Um, dang, that looks really good in the Gala colors. Uh, let's see, which skin do I want to use next? I think I'll go Future Spirit Artemis. This is a skin you can only get during Winter Holiday event, I think. And I will go... Here's... I'll show, I'll show you default colors. This skin I actually really like in the uh, Esports and Goldforge colors. It actually looks good in almost every single color. Here, let's just do random on the color. Oh, look at that! Esports, alright. And actually, guys... I don't know why it's defense. Let's do nine speed. Artemis. Okay, defense. Normally, I would recommend defense stance on Artemis because eight, uh, seven speed is already good. Um, but you know, or even just base. 
base would be fine. But if you want to go super fast, 9 speed takes away from dexterity. Dexterity is how fast you recover after you do an attack, so dexterity is really important, that kind of. But at the same time, you could argue that movement speed is more important than uh, recovery, because if you don't miss very often, it's not as big of a advantage, I guess. But movement speed, I mean, that that is something that you're going to be utilizing the entire match. All right, we're going against uh, Volkov, so Scythe versus Scythe here. I'm letting him get a weapon uh, just to start it out. I love the red Volkov, though. It's like such a nice color. Got the read on that jump. So the last guy didn't like to jump, but this guy does. I just realized his name is Red. Like, he's Red and his name is Red. <laughs> I don't know why that's funny. I wonder if he does that intentionally. Man, that side sync gets me more KOs than anything else because it's so fast and strong. Like, it really is. Hold that, thank you. This guy is scary, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I think it's just the axe. It's so, uh, so strong when you get hit. It makes you wanna not go in and try to attack yourself, but you really just need to beat the axe with speed. If they like to float in the air, a really good move is to just neutral air, which is to not do any direction. Ooh, nice fake, man. He faked me out like he was gonna land, spot dodge, Wait for me to do the move and then literally punish so hard. Beautiful play. We have a decent sized lead here, but that that can go fast with how he's shredding with sight. He dodged down. And he get the side zig again. Alright, so we got a pretty good lead. Doesn't really matter. I mean, we have a stock lead anyway. But the way this guy's been playing, he's going to bring it right back. Let's see if we can two-stock him. If not, at least we have that insurance stock. Oh my goodness, that throw almost got me. Again, the neutral air is doing a lot of damage to him. Oh, he lucky that that didn't hit him, but it's okay. I kind of got lucky on a few times too. Oh my goodness, my dodges are just impeccable. My lance isn't that bad. And we are doing really good on this stock, boys. Oh, the down sig! That's actually a hard move to hit, but if they poke their head up over the edge and you're lucky and you get that down sig out, it will destroy. But a lot of times I do it and I get punished, so I don't do it a whole lot. All right, let's do Netherworld Artibus. It's probably my third favorite. Um, I think I want to do this one with black colors, though, because it looks the most scary to me. So I love the Lance and the Scythe as well, because they just look... Oops. No, no I want to use the regular. Yeah, there we go. All right, that was Speed Stance. Uh, now let's try Base. And as you can see, it didn't really make that big of a difference when I was doing Defense or Speed Stance. Like, either way, we got the win. Um, so don't feel like if you're using the wrong stance, it's like gonna make or break your game. Chances are it's not that big of a deal. Um, and if you're not sure, just stay on default stance, to be honest. All right, going on Bunyan Boo, or what was his name? Going against Bunyan Bobo. <laughs> Boon Bunyan Bobo, what a funny name. All right, another Val, this time a Skyforged Val. Uh, very cool. I think he's also using the Akuma no Kogo Hattori sword from the first battle pass. The tier 85 Hattori skin sword. Very cool. Alright, she dodging up. So the last guy dodged down a lot and this one dodges up. So we have to remember that. Every time you do a side light to someone, you should be paying attention to how they react to the side light. Ooh, that was a nice play. Very nice. That reverse neutral sig off the uh, slide off off the stage was beautiful. I can tell this is gonna be a hard fight too, so 
in situations like this, you just gotta be, play very careful, but also stay aggressive. Try to play clean. Try to be unpredictable. That's what I'm doing here, basically. I Sometimes I move around weird just to be unpredictable. It makes it hard for them because you don't want to make it easy for them or get let them get in a rhythm. Did she just interrupt a side sig? Oh my goodness, she did. Very good gauntlet player, I can already tell. Oh, we got the touch and she still got us. Well played, well played. All right, she keeps on doing that combo to us, so I want to do that to her a couple times just to show that she's not the only one that can do it. You know what I mean? And this is where we got to clutch it because she is leading by a stock now. I basically have to reverse two stock. Oh, direct hit. Let's go. And the finish. All right, that's what I'm talking about. We evened it back up. Final stocks. This is what it's all about. Let's get this clutch win with Artemis Black versus Skyforged Val. Such an epic match. Don't have a weapon? No problem. We can edge guard pretty well unarmed. But I don't want to be unarmed forever. This guy is too good. The sword will punish too, too hard. But we're getting a lot of damage off without the weapon. That's important. You got to be able to fight well unarmed sometimes because... Good players will weapon guard hard. Let's go, Beth! Oh, this is coming down to the wire, baby. I love these kind of games. <laughs> GG! GG! That's how we do it, baby! Get that win right there! Losing the whole game and still get the win. Let's go. All right. That was a good match um, Please though. Let us fight somebody else. That's not a Val <laughs> Look at that skin. This is default Artemis guys with black colors. Look how good that visor looks. Oh my goodness Even default Artemis doesn't look bad. All right. Uh, we got one more match in us. I think ooh so many good choices I think I'm gonna go with mm, Serif Artemis, mm, Street Racer, Slapshot. We got a lot of choices. Should I do Slapshot? All right, I'll do Slapshot. You like never see this skin. Uh, I'll go random on the color. All right, I guess we're going haunting. Slapshot, this is a skin. I forget where it's even from. Actually, you know what it is? I think it's back to school. So actually, back to school event isn't that far away. Come to think of it, back to school events probably starting in two weeks, two, three weeks, I would guess. I'm pretty sure the, the next battle pass is starting this this week, like this coming week if you're watching this today. Like, I'm pretty sure it's going to come out like Wednesday, Thursday, something like that, Friday. Uh, this guy has honor, by the way. But the back to school pa uh, patch should also be coming out shortly after the battle pass. It would have to, really. I missed him by an inch. You want to play off edge? Right near. I can do this. Nope. Back on stage. Hold the scythe. Hold the spiky. Now I'm defenseless. Or am I? Oh, the neutral sig. Woo! We got him with the weapon throw into the gravity cancel. That was sick. Let's go. We got a great start so far. But, oh, that axe is really strong. We gotta watch out for that one. Maybe we can gimp him again? Oh my goodness, I did a recovery right into the flames! By the way, that axe he's using, oof, that's a nice looking axe. I gave away that axe skin uh, a couple days ago. And I'll be dropping another skin after this video as well. All right, all right, all right. He's scared of the land. See, he don't even want to come up to me when... Okay, okay, never mind. He's not scared. Oh, take it. Yeah, you want another one? Oh, he does. 
You may be fast, Ragnar, but you're not as fast as Artemis. Straight up, Artemis has more speed. We have to use it to our advantage. No, that's the fireball of death. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, she got me with the axe. Okay, she actually took the lead right there. Oh, 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 not for long. All right, final stocks, last option. Let's go, baby. Clutch it time. Oh, oh, oh. Got her. Oh. Oh, she lured me back off stage. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Ragnar. Come and get it. We are doing so good with the lance. Oh my goodness. Woo! Nice side air. Oh my gosh. Well played, dude. Well played. That was a good match. Anyways, guys. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that video on Artemis. Uh, it was a pretty fun, I mean, pretty fun video. You know, I don't play Artemis very often. I think the last time I did an Artemis video was over a year ago. So definitely was... Uh, time to do a new Artemis video. Let me know what you thought in the comments below and as always Let me know who you'd like me to play in the next video. This is Lucian Sword. I hope to see you in the next video. Take it easy friends